Zoho Show Tutorial for Beginners Step by Step. Hello guys, Ilya here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we use presentation software by Zoho. Basically it's not that hard and the interface is quite friendly. So here we are on zoho.com in show area and we have some options here. We can just simply click on create presentation to start creating. Of course maybe you'll have to sign in. So let's try to sign in with Gmail. Yeah, basically this is the easiest way to communicate with different online services. We can connect them to our like Google account. And here we are on Zoho Show dashboard. In the left side, as you can see, we have some options. We can add a new presentation. We can also upload it. We can find all of our presentations, recents, my presentation shared with us and offline presentation. And also we have like library only for premium version and gallery with themes, templates, slides and some other stuff. So in the gallery, we can find a lot of useful things we can easily use by our own. So as you can see, there are a lot of themes we can use. And in this case, in this video, I'm going to use one of these themes to make it easier to interact. But I will show you also how can we edit something by our own. Also, we have like a lot of different templates in different like categories. HR, personal, marketing, education, technology, students and so on. And also there is like different slides we can easily use. So I think it's also like pretty, pretty cool. So let's go to themes and we'll try to find something suitable as for us. I think, you know, that we can easily use this one here. So let's click. And as you can see in the right uh, like side, we can find a lot of options we can customize, at least like color scheme and the font scheme. So we can easily try to find some suitable fonts as for us. In my case, that's okay. I'm going to click on create presentation or we can click on plus presentation in the left top corner to create it from scratch. So let's click on plus in the right bottom corner to use this theme. And here we are on our like online presentation software. In the top of the screen, we have like a small menu here. And in the right side, there is like uh, properties of current slide we have. So in order to add some new slides, we need to click on plus right up here. And as you can see, new slide was successfully added. To interact with slides, we need to click on right mouse button. So here we can cut, copy, paste, we can add new slide, we can duplicate, delete. Sometimes we can duplicate if like we have two similar slides, but we need to change only one, like one text or something like this. We can hide or show slide, we can lock slide. We can change layout if we need, there are a lot of different like themes and templates we can use. And also we can download this slide as a JPEG image or PNG image. Also we can add comments. We also have the option for more layouts. As you can see there are a lot of features we can use. The same as for change layout. We can undo or redo our options we already did. And I also suggest you to set up the name of our presentation. Let it be like helper man one like this. Um, also in the top of the screen there is the option to add some text, media, shapes, tables, chart and add odds. So basically uh, on our slide we have like two text area where we can add text. So we can add the title, for example slide one. Also we can add some text. In order to interact with this text to change the uh, styles we need to select it and in the right uh, side we can find some options. We can make it bold, italic, underlined, change some other stuff, change the alignment, change the font and so on. Basically all the like editor page is right up here. We can also animate this text and in this way we can animate every single uh, like part. We can animate images, shapes and so on. So let's add animation for example for a peer. So and, and also I'd like to increase by increase it by you know uh, duration for a little. So now it looks like this. We can play this slide and as you can see uh, now our like text appears right up here. And in this case we can animate every single element. Also we can delete elements by simply choosing them and then just click on delete. So let's add shape. For example we need to add the rectangle like this. Let's also add the 
maybe let's try to add the line and then we can add one more shape like maybe a graph or something like this we can also add media we can add it from the uh, our like computer or we can pick from word drive so maybe sometimes it could be easier as for us to upload it from here so basically this is the way also we can add different charts we can add like cluster columns stock column 100 percent stock column and so on there's a lot of different categories we can use for example like this here uh, and to manage the information we just simply need to click or if you'll try to add one more chart for example this we can find all the like information we can update so we can change the series one series two series three and so on so in this case it's pretty easy and pretty useful even better than like maybe some of microsoft products or google products um, there are a lot of different like charts by the way you can find the necessary design as for you and also we can add like simple text we have like different text areas like simple text text within like some frames or something like this so this is the way of how can we add some text so let's add this one for example we can uh, replace it so let's try to place it somewhere here and then we can write like subscribe to my channel and as you can see every single element has its own properties in the right uh, side so basically we can format we can change the texture or something like this we can fill make it like solid or gradient make it an image or something like this and do some other stuff here we can also add the animation or we can add the review and in this case we can create a lot of different slides fill them by different like uh, you know uh, objects and then just play them as we need so it will click on play we can easily like switch between these parts here and as you can see uh, the animation and the presentation works pretty good pretty good so if you we'll click on uh, like logo in the left top corner we'll come back to our dashboard and from this page here we can easily manage this presentation we can click on download and it will be successfully downloaded we can like save it as a ms powerpoint presentation open document presentation ms powerpoint or pdf so it's pretty cool they provides us the opportunity to save it as pdf for example so let's try to save it may take a little time and uh, we can even continue without downloading anything and as you can see it was successfully downloaded to my computer so this uh, software is totally free but they also have like some paid plans i think we can try to find them right up here so this is a way of how can we use zoho uh, zoho uh, show to create presentation hope guys this video helped you out please do like comment and subscribe i wish you a very good day goodbye